Women's 100 meters T12, fourth and final first round heat. And Rose Walepa, I note, does not start for France. So there's only two in this heat. So it's a straight foot race. Walepa, well, that's a pity. She doesn't start, but the fastest woman in the world this year going into the Paralympic Games does. Elena Chibano of Azerbaijan, who's seen her world lead beaten earlier this morning. And Sara Martinez of Spain, a brilliant long jumper. The Madrileño, two in a row, European champion in the long jump. Potentially recently engaged too, judging from the ring. But Chibanu, 11.79 earlier this year, silver in the 100 meters behind Omara Durand in the World Championships in Doha last year and bronze in the two. Former Ukrainian now for Azerbaijan. So Martinez opting to run without the guide as is her choice. Chibano with Hakim Ibrahimov. Way first time and look at Chibano go, she's away here. It's her against the clock more than anything else. 11.58 from Durand in the opening heat. Easing up a little bit towards the line, 12.24. She ran very much within herself there. She knew exactly what she wanted to do. And in the end, she didn't want a blistering time. So Durand will have the fastest time in the world this year going into the semi-finals. And Martinez in the end found herself quite a bit behind and she will be eliminated. Well, Chibano would have been well aware that Martinez, with a personal best of 13.27, was not a threat to her. All she needed to do was cross the line first, and maybe she did have plenty to draw on if needed. Certainly got away quickly. As much as anything, it's a, it's a training run. And practice a quick start, she certainly had that, and was easing up on the line to go across in 12.24, well outside what she can do. Well inside Muller Rotgart's 12.48, but a fair way outside Omara Durand, who's 11.58 in heat one. It was mightily impressive and well under the old Paralympic record, who perhaps didn't make enough of that at the time and beat the old Paralympic record by 0.3. So we know Durand is the one to beat. Really interested she did that, though, Steve. 